I walk like I talk like I act like I look like I think like my shit don't stink. I fuck like I suck like I ride like I taste like I look like my shit don't stink. I walk like I talk like I. What is up, y'all? My headphones in. About to do fasted cardio, but we're gonna vlog today because I am traveling. Not traveling. I just am driving to a bodybuilding show that's like two hours away today, but there's a dope gym there, so I'm gonna go and train there, but obviously I'm in prep and I have to bring my meals, so I thought I'd show you just come and spend the day with Kenzie, but I'll show you what I'm wearing to cardio presently. Um, I just got this jacket. It's the Super Pro from Aritzia. I was gonna get a big long one, but I was like, let me just have this one have a little short little puffer because I do think it's a bit dramatic to be wearing a parka down to my ankles in October. Um, whatever. These are my Shein sunglasses that you always ask about. White fox pants. And then I just got these new little mini Uggs. I've wanted them for a while. I used to hate them when they first came out, but I don't know. They feel like little clouds. I'm a little insecure because I have big feet, but aren't they cute? Okay, anyways, this is like earlier that I don't want to do cardio. It's like 9.30. So we're going to go and get this hour fasted cardio done, come home, eat. I'm going to do some more work, um, and then I'll probably leave here around like, mm, what, 1, 2? I'm trying to think. I think finals is at 5 because I want to go there, train, and then I'll go to the show. So that's going to be my day. It's just... It's just... You'll see. All right, let's go get cardio done. All right, y'all, we are showered back home. I'm just making my first meal, which is the same every day. Um, ground turkey, mushrooms, spinach, hot sauce, and then I have three eggs right here. I'm gonna eat this, finish my coffee, pack the rest of my meals. I'm just gonna show you once it's all packed because I'm, shocker, she's running late. So I'll catch up in a second. Okay, so this is the cooler situation. I got it for like 40 bucks at Target. I use her all the time. I just have ice packs. Yes, I'm bringing both my flavor game sauces, sriracha maple and the takeout sauce. And then I just labeled all my meals. So this is me, my pre-workout, post-workout, and then I'll have another meal probably at the show because the show's going to be long, most likely, because the finals always is. Um, oh, yeah. And then I just put my intro workout powder in there. So I'll just add water when I'm at the gym. But I need to pack, like, my clothes. So I'm going to do that, and then we'll talk. All right, y'all, I'm hoping you can see me. We are in the car. We need to get gas, though. Low-key, this is, I'm really cutting it close. Like, this is going to be the quickest, like, day of my life. Like, I low-key might have to do cardio later. But also, I feel like I don't have to be there at 5. Because women always go last. So it's like, mm, do I have to be there right away? I don't really think so. So, there's that. All right. Okay, person in the car. Um, I don't really know what else to say. Yeah, I'm about to go and get gas. I need to get water there. And some kind of energy drink fun. Just because it's a lot of driving and not a lot of food. But And then I have my pre-workout meal. I need to get a fork at this gas station because I forgot to pack a fork. But other than that, I brought literally everything else. Um, yeah, I'm hoping they have like a bathroom. Because sometimes those like... Just like your cooler, like, private gyms don't have, like, locker rooms. They'll have, like, a, like, single bathroom. But I need, like, a towel or something so I can, like, wipe myself down. I'm going to attempt to have my hair not be absolutely disgusting. We shall see, though. It's really not, eh, whatever. It'll be fine. Um, my friend went on for pre-judging this morning. I saw a little clip of her on her story. But women always go last, so I honestly, think, I think I'm fine. All right, y'all, we just got gas. The guy at the gas station, he did not laugh when I was like, can you tell I'm prepping for a bodybuilding show based on my purchases? Because I got my gallon of water, so I'm probably going to stop to pee. And then this place, I'm going to drink this right now. It's the Raised Berries and Cream. It's so good. It's just like a berry version, essentially, of um, like the orange creamsicle. I got that. I got some icebreakers because they didn't have fucking Tic Tacs. And then this was a fun flavor, I thought. Galaxy Blast. I got some bubble mint gum and then the Swedish Fish um, 
Ghost, and I think I got the Orange Creamsicle one too. But I got that and then my gallon, but I need to leave because I'm definitely going to have to do cardio afterwards, but I realize it's fine because, like, when you go to shows, they're, like, motivating. Like, I'm going to be, like, ready to fucking go. Like, I know once I'm done with the show, like, I'm not going to be, like, uh, cardio and be, like, let's go do cardio. So, I will see you guys when we're there, when we get to the gym. Alright, you guys, we made it to Animal House Gym. It, we're in New Berlin, Wisconsin. I texted Ada. She was, uh, dead center prejudging, so that's good news. Um, basically means she's gonna win her class. Um, but she told me, she's like, you don't have to be here till like, 6.37. So, that's perfect. So, I'm gonna train legs. I'm, I'll film stuff on my phone. I'll try, but I think I'm gonna try to do, like, Instagram content when I'm there, so. I don't know. I don't like filming when I go to gyms for the first time. I just feel annoying. Like, I just feel like that Instagram bitch. Um, but yeah, we'll talk. You guys will see me. All right, y'all, change of plans. Um, I got to that gym, and they close at 4 on Saturdays. So we are at Vasa Fitness. I don't know if you guys can see that. So we're going to go check it out, see what they have to offer. It's giving me export vibes, but it's new. It says that they just opened, so let's, we'll see. Started the gym. I didn't film anything there because... It was just like loud and I just I was already the bitch that like filmed two sets and like you guys I just haven't been in a commercial gym in so long I forgot how much people stare like just like shameless like we're both making eye contact back at each other and you just don't stop staring at me like it was wild but I did meet one of you guys there she came up to me in the bathroom and she was like I was fangirling out there with my boyfriend like whatever and I was like, girl, no, I promise, like, regular as fuck. So right now I'm at a gas station because I forgot a fork, and then I need to get my ass to this convention center. All right, y'all. We got the lettuce, the chicken, the sriracha maple flavor gang. They didn't have regular forks, which is weird, but they had, like, the boxes of them. And then since I'm a piece of shit, I got a new flavor of a vape because that is the only thing that gets me through this fucking prep. If we're going to be real here. So I'm going to eat this. Eat this so, like, it's not overflowing on me. Then I'll drive. So, what the fuck is my camera doing? No, no. Um, so yeah. Alright, you guys, I'm waiting for Atta to go on. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I'm waiting for Atta to go on. They're just finishing up men's. So, I was watching Classic. They're doing men's physique awards right now, and then she'll do hers. But I'm gonna show you guys how they do comparisons and stuff during the overall so you guys can kind of get a like a idea of my show because this is like the same kind of show it's a local show it's a regional level show so i'm just kind of show you guys that and then we'll get to see her right after hello <laughs> i was just saying i was like wellness girl <laughs> i would just like to make it known that this was not something i wanted to do but my friend told me to do it and i decided i'd do it for the vlog so i did it for y'all Okay, low-key at this point I thought I had a chance and then this girl walks up right after me. Just fucking wait. Literally, I think this is the point where I was like, fuck you. Like, I was like, literally, why do I have to stand next to this girl? Like, what the fuck is this? Like, look at her fucking arms, her triceps, her delts, her biceps, bro. And then just watch her absolutely mog me. Bro, what? And this was the sweet girl that I forgot to take a picture with. So if you're watching this, I'm sorry. But I told her this is us like saying hi to the vlogs. I told her it was being vlogged. But yeah. And this is me just being my hilarious charismatic self. Because I didn't want to stand by her. Because she's so fucking swole. I quite literally contemplated making a side-by-side -side of our front double buys, but then I decided that my confidence could not take that at seven weeks out right now. Like, no way in hell. Jesse Landeros. 
take our second place award and present it to tonight's runner-up competitor number 69, Hank Bulgan, Hank Taiwan. And your winner of our Wellness Open Class A, how about a big round of applause for competitor number 67, Ata Batagi. Alright, ladies, I'm gonna have y'all take one step in towards each other, arms around the waist. So, tell me your name. I'm Lexi. Lexi's competing at the same show as me. Yep. Seven weeks, baby! Hey there. <laughs> Let's go. Quarter turn to the right. Switch sides. Quarter turn to the right. Looking good, 67. Quarter turn to the right. Quarter turn to the right. And quarter turn to the right. Okay, David. All right, ladies, if you could make your way back over to our diagonal line where the judges are finalizing their score. What do you guys think? Who's going home with that overall title here tonight? For our wellness division, make some fun. 67, baby! All right, Tim, we have our award presenters. We're gonna make their way out on stage. And actually, if we could have our awards presenters come out on stage here, we just wanna show them some love. They've been working hard all evening. Now, the overall wellness champion is gonna be going home with the overall trophy. They're gonna be taking home the Niels Anderson sword, the crown, the custom weight belt, the Air Force backpack with gifts from our sponsors. They're gonna be getting our shredded cheddar cooler bag, the one gold gear shirt, sexy beads clothing and cup. I got the Arctic water bottle, flavor gang sauces and oats, the Animal House clothing, lifting straps from Sheik, gift box from Six Pack Meats for the $120 ship right to their door, a 3D scan for free from <clears throat> model printing, or rather the free 3D scan and model printing from Spirit Led Development and Gold Rush Untamed pre-workout. So here at the Badger State, if you take home and overall, you get a, a nice prize package here. And we are going to take uh, that entire prize package and title of 2022 NPC Badger State Wellness Overall Champion and present it to your winner, ladies and gentlemen, number 67, Atta Bertani.
Kayla, when I tell him this shit, sometimes no, really. when we Can I see your back post? I feel One like more time. <laughs> the wellness back post. Yes. Kayla, when I His tell him this shit, shits on I feel like mine. he thinks I'm hyping him up. Dude. He's got world class oh, shit legs. Shits on my back post. I like it boots like that. No, we don't have to weeks, take huh? the fucking picture anymore, guys. Good God. You guys, it's dark as fuck, but I just got out of there. I was so cute. I'm so happy for her. Um. But just, just knowing her like journey, I'm just, I'm happy for her. She got the overall. Um, so did Brad, so that's exciting. Um, they're both my friends and he coaches her. Um, but what I'm doing right now is I'm just eating my last, not my last meal actually, shit, I'm covering the camera. Um, it's literally just lettuce, chicken, and then hot sauce, and then I forgot to eat the two rice cakes post-workout, so I'm gonna eat those. And then head back to Chicago, it's like an hour and a half away, and then I'll go home, I have like two eggs, some chicken, um, and veggies to eat before bed and then that'll be my day so i don't know sorry the lighting's fucking trash um but no it was good i was i met like a lot of you guys in there too they fucking convinced me to do the you guys the best arms pose off that they were doing at this shit i was like whatever fuck it vlog it kayla i get up there and because i was like my arms are lean we know my arms aren't big but they're lean so i did like the whole like ah, thing up there um but then of course who stands next to me this woman who's in her, like, basically just, like, uh, she's probably in her 40s, 50s, probably old woman's physique competitor, just massive fucking arms. Like, I, literally, I look at her, she gets, I was like, girl, what, I was like, come on, she's like, I'm sorry, I was like, girl, like, come on, none of us want to stay next to her, I was like, I gotta stay next to you, what the fuck is this? Um, but I met some of you guys, one of the girls on stage, she knew me from TikTok, fuck, I was supposed to get a picture with her and I never did, I, if you're watching this, I'm sorry, god fuck and then i met this other girl too it was funny because her boyfriend wasn't like they were sitting in front of me and her boyfriend turns around and he's like hey can she get a picture with you she's too afraid to ask i was like yeah <laughs> um but yeah that was a good day today it's like my food is low and kerrigan took out my high carb day so it's just all low carb days all around and even though i'm eating like nothing and doing all this cardio like days like this are nice because i'm busy so i can't even think about it like the fact that i have two meals left to eat meals the meal being chicken and lettuce um but yeah, so, I don't know, it's a good day. All right, boy. All right, y'all, we are back home. Traffic was fucking wild by my house because Harry Styles is in town for like the fucking seventh day in a row, I swear to God. But anyways, we're back. It was a good day. I don't know, after I like any kind of travel day when I'm cutting, prepping, whatever it is, like when I get home and the day is done, it's just like, you fucking did it. Like my friend's wedding, I remember like coming home, like, like obviously I wasn't eating the food, I wasn't drinking the drink, so I'd bring my meal prep, I'd eat in my car, like just whenever I could. I remember getting home, I was like, you did it. Like you survived it. Like it's kind of like on the days that cardio fucking sucks and you're like, oh my God, how am I gonna get through this? But it's the feeling afterwards of like, I fucking did it. Even though it was nice because I was busy today, like given like, I'm obviously my food is not that high. So I don't really know on my phone where I'm supposed to look at, so sorry about this. Um, but it was so good. Um, my workout was good. I got to meet a lot of you guys today. I was shocked, honestly. Like, I was in Wisconsin. I met, like, three or four of you. So if we took a picture together or anything, um, that one girl, I'm sorry, I forgot to find you again. I apologize. But if we took a picture together, please tag me or send me in it. Or send it to me. Um, but yeah, I'm actually gonna try to upload this and start to edit this tonight. I just have to eat chicken and, like, 150 grams of green beans and two eggs. That's gonna be... My last meal of the night to finish off some fat. Um, and yeah, so that's that's that. That's a Saturday in Kenzie's life. Um, I wish I kind of got to film some more stuff for you, but I literally just felt like a circus animal in that place, you guys. It was so weird. When I get questions from you guys now in my Q&As, I genuinely have more empathy for you. Because people will always be like, how do you deal with people staring at the gym? I have not experienced this in years. Like where people, like you are just like, eye contact like just like staring me down like I was I felt like so and not to be like everybody's always looking at me like because eh. I normally don't think that way I'm always like like whenever I have friends are like oh my people are staring I'm like they're not staring like you're just thinking about you so you think everybody else is thinking about you no today was fucking wild bro and when I met one of the girls in the bathroom I told her she's like bro she's like because you're so vast queer right now oh I was shook y'all I was like bro what is this I filmed like RDL's and what um bulgarians but i just was like not trying to film the way that i still went on tiktok live during cardio though oh my god good fuck 
Um, but yeah, I don't know. Now I'm just rambling at this point. So whatever. I'm going to eat this meal and get my ass to bed because it's like 11 o'clock and I'm tired. So that's that. All right. Bye, I guess. Who you a fool for this? Who you a fool for this? I walk like I talk like I act like I look like I think like my shit don't stink. I fuck like I suck like I ride like I taste like I look like my shit don't stink. I walk like